All right, and ladies and gentlemen, we are back. We are desperately trying to find the vampire power. That's the next one. Lama Su sent us into this other room, trying to get us where we need to go. Ugh. So if we check the overworld, we're trying to get to the lower right. Maybe we should go back that way. Let's try and follow the story. We'll come back up there and explore that big stuff later. Now if I go to the left, I didn't start by going left. If I go to the left, am I going to find a door? No, that's what that is. Okay. Oh, but I can't because of that. Oh, okay. So I bet you dollars donuts, actually. I bet you if I come up here and find the vampire power, the vampire power is what gets me into the room where Lamasu wants me to go. I don't know why I'm just doing whatever these guys tell me to do. Ooh, what do we have here? Whoever finds this. Sorry. <laughs> if this is the end, then it's time I pass on what I know. It all starts with Dr. Eschenbrenner, who first discovered the breach and was traveling to alternate realities before Hammond Corp was even formed. His great fear was the technologies of the world stream would prove too dangerous and destructive for Earth, and he implored me to keep it secret until he could discover what happened at the root. Though I doubted him at first, the more I learned, the more I was inclined to agree. The apocalypse arms alone could be catastrophic to our world. It's now been decades since he left Earth. I had mounted his latest expedition to try and follow him, but since I am not pattern mind, the hurdles are great. I'm not a pattern mind. Sorry. For what it's worth, my next step will be to find a device called the screw. Possibly somewhere in the filter? Scry. Screw. Jeez. This, taken with a piece of his DNA, would be able to find his exact location. Clearly, there is something gravely amiss here. The barriers between the worlds are slowly de degenerating. No apparent attempts being made to correct course. We must do something. Eh! P5! <laughs> if you see Warham, tell him it's not his fault. When the drones attacked, I thought I'd be clever and hide in the ruins, but the entrance is closed off. I suspect the Lamasu bears responsibility for that. Hammond. Pendant. Those bastards. Name the reference. I'll give you a dollar. Okay. And so, yep, I'm stuck here, so hopefully, I guess I have to use breach tractor. Ah, good thing it works. Take care of that. Aha! This is where we were, yep. Okay, so maybe not vampire power. Maybe the vampire power is the thing. Very climactic. At long last, I am free from these primordial bonds. I now find, now to find the portal of Ansur. Cute. We arrived just in time. You have to stop her. I saw some. I saw inside her mind. If she destroys Ansor, it all ends. I'll never see Samara. She's not breathing. It seemed like she was back to being Indra again, and now she's dead. So what does that make me? And that big red thing is that is that the last Sayuna? 
An empty bottle is just waiting for an arm to take over, and that Ansur place is supposed to have more of them. Do you really think Amma Shalama wants to destroy the world? I'm not sure that's... I'm not sure that's what she means to happen, though I don't exactly want to find out if she's right either. Ah, oh, it's a bummer. You couldn't get your body back. What have we here? Vampire power! What have I been saying since like episode three? I am Tilhar. With me you become a cloud, able to pass through cracks and grates. Been seeing grates all over the since I've arrived. It's like a damn motif. Indeed, these barriers were once a way of the wielders were finally able to entrap the vanquished Udug. So, okay, so how do I use this thing? Show me my inventory. Oh, neat. Okay, okay, cool, cool, cool. Um, that wasn't the button that I wanted to assign it to. Also allows me to fly, which isn't kind of cool. Wielder! We are in grave danger. I see. She's been looking for the portal of Ansur. Yes, she means to obtain the rest of the Sanua cache. Then she will destroy our mother world with legion of arms. I think you need to explain a bit what this means. In the same way that destroying the universe would mean destroying all the planets within the universe, destroying the Ansar will destroy all the universes within it. What sort of insanity makes her think this is a good idea? She believes that this universe can somehow survive independently of the Mother. Idra, it is paramount that you stop her. At the portal to the Sanua Cache is an undetonated storm breach bomb left over from the world. All that is needed is for you to activate it. Where is it? 4318, beneath your people's research base. It was nearly discovered by them, which is why I sent drones to chase them from the area. Sounds dangerous. What's the, best, what's the blast radius of the bomb? The walls are of a material not native to this world and should contain the blast. Okay, I'll check it out. If you say so, I'll set it to blow. And then you'd better find me a way to get back into my own body. We have an agreement. All right. Blow this uh, place to smithereens. So, I didn't look to see what numbers he said. I'm sure, it's going to take me a minute to get out there, too. Is this this one? I guess so. Really just eat through my energy really quickly.
go straight across. Ah, uh, what about Death Star? Like, should I do something to attack the Death Star? I I'm surprised I didn't have to do anything with that. Oh, that's not the way. Not the way. Uh, okay, back to down one, then go to the right. I mean, there was a Death Star in there, but never had to do anything with that. I'm intrigued by all these, you know, big monsters that... that you don't, you know, you don't really have to do anything with. They just, they're just there. It's a neat idea. Kind of like uh, Link Between Worlds. Interesting. I gotta stop doing that. There's just too too many um, options here for controls. Um, let's do it. This is probably gonna totally mess me up now. If I make this, and then that's better, I think. Okay, there's nothing in here but an apocalypse flask. Neat. Okay, fun. Good times. Definitely need more of those, you know, because reasons. Hmm. So. You need to get up there. Groovy music, I like it. So if I just for kicks do this, how high can I fly? This looks like something fun. Serious. Is that it? I don't think so. Do I need to breach my way into this? Might have to breach my way into this. Is there a breach portal? No, there's no portal I want. Well, let's do this. Um, let's get totally distracted by these couple of things that we don't need. Uh, ah, yeah. Okay, that's easy enough. 
just hop over there and up to the left and then breach my way out. Oh, wait, wait, wait. I can't breach my way out. Surely I've been this. Let's try it. Let's try it. What's the fastest way to get into the breach? Let's try it. Lots to explore. And of course, now it's, it's starting to feel like a collectathon. Um, I'm intrigued. I'm very intrigued. I hate that I can't be like, buddy, give me those numbers again. Oh, I see. Nice. Okay, let me just, uh... yep, here's as good as any, I guess. Cool. So how do I get up there and how do I open this door? Oh, good, I can breach back in and that probably opens the door. Breach tractor, right? But there's, well, let's just see what happens. Halam out of here. Get the Halam out of here. Yeah, I mean, I can breach a tractor my way over here, but it's just, it's coming in, but I can't use it here. That was easy. All right, no more collectathon. Let's finish this game. If we were to do a collectathon later, we can do a collectathon later. Although I want to see what's up to the left. Erg. Just up to the left. I 
I like, this is a very clever use of like the whole two worlds thing. I'm, I'm genuinely intrigued by this. All right, so it looks like the answer is nothing. Coop, coop, coop. I know, I said I wouldn't collect a thon, and yet here I am trying to get every piece of the map that I possibly can. I don't know, now that I got the vampire power. Do you see what I, and I have no, I have no, um, and I probably can't, yeah. That's frustrating. I don't know why I can't set a reminder. Oh, because I haven't been there yet. Oh, interesting. Okay. All right. And then what is it that I can't get to over here? I'm so used to jumping over. I, I, I really just play more with the drone than anything else, which is kind of silly. Intriguing. Okay. Okay. Yeah, I didn't think so. Which way are we going? Let's go back over this way. It's enough of the collectathon. I've said that eight times and now I'm already talking like, look, I can just go to the upper left on the map right there. Aha! See, aren't you glad I did this? I need another apocalypse flask. I need it! <laughs> okay, I got my apocalypse flask. Now let's go set this bomb off. This is the way, right? Nope. The apocalypse last. Do not enter. Is this the right way? Yeah, I think I think so. Go this way. Just stay all the way to the right. Stay to the right. No, wait, wait, wait. Is this the way? Yep. The Ansible's been powered on. Hammond, are you there? Yes, thanks to you I have circumvented the character limits of this terminal. Something's come up, Amashalama, she got the last Sayuna, but she wants to find the rest, which were somewhere below us. From what I know of them, they're very, very dangerous, like sandstorms. Uh, the, at least the locals think so. The Lama Sue says she wants to use them to destroy the Ansur, the mother world, because she thinks it'll somehow free us. Is this a plausible thing? 
Oh, God, no, Ender. That would literally mean the end of the universe. Even if Amish Lama thinks, thinks so, this universe could survive. Even then, the places Samara and I are in would be forever disconnected. You would never see Samara again. I was starting to suspect as much. I think you understand, though. Then, please don't let Amish Lama do this. I'm about to set off a breach bomb. Apparently, it's the only thing that can destroy the portal leading to the light source. So if you don't hear from me again, if I don't hear from you again, it's because you cease to exist. So please don't let that happen. It's quiet all of a sudden. Lamasu! Uh, Indra, an upstream portal lies ahead, at least to the Onsor. I had the Sayuna cache placed there to keep it secure, but this has since been exactly the place Amish Lama needs to do the most damage. And we're so afraid computers were going to be smarter than us. I missed what you said. After that, I'll seal the doors. Yeah, I heard that before. And then nobody can ever get to the cache again, right? Only a pattern mind could do that, and there are none left in this world. Sounds like a Chekhov's gun. But I've suspected a few other, like, potential. And the thing is, I haven't fought any bosses, so, like, combat, I'm not, like, super rad at combat. So, if I'm gonna fight, like, a combat boss? Not so fast, Indra. This is neat. I like this idea. You wouldn't want to destroy that portal now, would we? Amashalama! This portal leads to the Ansor, the mother world. Once I've obtained the remaining Sayuna, we will destroy it. And in the process, destroy this world too. A matter of semantics. I will return to its original form. It will become part of the pure realm of ideas once again. Those living in the current world will no longer exist to experience the destruction of it. Yeah, that's a bunch of nonsense, and I'm not, allowed, not about to let that happen. I like it. It's the same music as... I wonder why I can't open it. Oh, because I already did. This is cool, this is kind of like the ending of Portal. And we got the uh, throwback music going on. Oh, I see what you're doing. Okay. All right. Well, I should have opened the first one. 
Okay, so I do have that central platform I can hang out on. I guess I should have opened the top ones first. That would have made this a lot easier. Oh, you got me! Whoa, 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 whoa! Nice shooting, Tex! Didn't, it didn't make it all the way through. You'll never take me alive, Kappa. <laughs> How convenient. Oh no, she's got me. Enough! You don't think I know what you're trying to do? I was here when that bomb was made! I, I don't know what I'm trying to do. Where did you come from? Indra, hack the bomb! <gasps> How? Choke. And then get the hell out of here! I'll keep her busy! Detonate! Which way am I supposed to go? Can't save, okay, no big deal. Oh, what is that? <laughs> I'm gonna have to come back and check that out. Interesting that these things are sealing up. Lamasu, don't talk to me now! <laughs> I don't have time for dialogue. I gotta get the hizzle out of dizzle. Dang. That was intense. True to what the Lamasu said, the breach bomb completely obliterated the portal to Ansur. We had survived. Damu and myself. Or at least some version of myself. The other me, she died to protect everyone. I realized then that I didn't care about getting home anymore. So I promised Damu that no matter what happened, I'd find a way to fix him. To make him flesh and blood again. And I knew where I could find the technology for that. But ironically, I'd just blown up the only known way to get there. So I was going to need help. Lamasu? And so you've come to me, hoping that I can help you reach the Ansur. But by your own omission, that was Amashalama's goal. Are you sure you were completely free of her influence? Of course! That was where they stored their most advanced tech. I think you too would find it lucrative. But in order to get there, we would need a pattern mind. And Hammond, do you think she is there too? I don't pretend to have any idea where Hammond is. I tried contacting you using the Ansible, but they're all dead now. But I feel like she and Samara are still around somewhere. The Ansible is dead, not Hammond and Samara. Very well, I look forward to working with you, Idra. I don't think I can really call myself Idra anymore. Real Idra died saving us. I'm something else. Ah! 
Okay, that was that was cool. Kind of kind of kind of bleh. Like what? Okay. What was the point? I didn't really feel very connected to any of those characters. But I like the, 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 the world hopping mechanic. That was pretty neat. You know, between, between the, uh, the breach and the, the world. That's a neat graphic. I like that. Built using Brute. Mod, graphic, graphic scale, model game, perfers, Photoshop, shader toy, sonar, sound forge, spine, tiled, ultra edit, visual studio, wave light of elements. Wish I could do stuff like this. I know I could. I, I definitely have the talent to do it um, and the perseverance to, to figure out what I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. At the time, I have other interests. So maybe I don't have the perseverance for it because I have other interests. I'm playing games. Thing physically fit. <laughs> Hanging out with my kids. Bust the wolf. Totally missed who, what, what is this, what this is. These are all like the Patreons or something. Jerry Hap, Judy Hap, Laura Hap. That's cool. Brothers and sis, brother, sisters, mom, dad, sister. John Cap. Candace Lee, Ethan Lee, Rachel Lee. Lemmy Lehman. Demetrius Gyrus. Definitely preferred the first one. I thought the first one was way cooler. But I wonder if that's just as I'm gaining in years, me just nostalgia. Like it felt like Super Metroid, whereas this was like new and weird. I think we need to be cognizant of that as we critique media. I think we need to be aware that we're watching it through our own lens and it means something to us for, for what reason. Me? And of course, me? I think there are a few truths that I really hold really, really strongly. Um, you know, one of them is, I was watching an interview about the makers of Diablo, like they, they, they wanted the time from game start to killing your first monster to be really short. Final stats, total time, 11, 22, 48, 30. Items, 70%. Map, 89%. Death count. 48, I don't know if that's good. I didn't really try to keep the death count low. Try to keep the kill count nice and high. It, I mean, really intrigued, like there were no bosses or anything. And that ending boss was like, you know, Portal 2. Kind of cool. Um, didn't hate it. Solid game, definitely cool. I think I'll do one more episode and um, try to be completionist. But uh, there you have it, folks. Thanks for watching. Uh, come back for the last episode if you want to see me do a little bit of item completion. I don't think I'm trying to 100% it, but let's screw around the world. Let's find some more stuff. And um, there you have it. Now I can get on to Metroid Dread. Appreciate it.